Hi, where are you? I can't see anything. Help. Oh, that's better. Hello. Today I'm going to teach you about woo -hoo, woo -hoo, glasses. These are sunglasses. But what I'm going to teach you about today are more important than sunglasses. They are glasses for bad eyesight. So, if you have bad eyesight, maybe you do this when you try and read something. Or you look far away and you... This is what I'm doing with my eyes. It's a verb. And it's called squint or squinting. So I, or maybe you, squint because you can't see something properly. If this has happened to you, you might be a victim of bad eyesight. So you need to go to an eye doctor. Now, um, a lot of doctors like to use bigger words to make it more difficult for you to actually contact someone. So in um, doctor words, an eye doctor's proper name is an optometrist. If you speak a Latin-based language, maybe you use the same word. Opto means eye, and optometrist means, eh, I don't know, doctor? I don't know, but I do know that opto means eye. So an eye doctor in the proper form is optometrists. If you have a problem with your eyes, you have to go to an eye doctor. And they will get lots of money from you, do lots of tests, and then you get to wear glasses. Cool. So the very, very first thing is we have two adjectives to describe why you may have bad eyesight. These are the most common phrases that people use. Now, because these two words end in ed, and they are adjectives. Because these are adjectives, like every adjective in English, you have to use the verb to be. So you cannot say I nearsighted or I farsighted. You have to say I am nearsighted or I am farsighted. So nearsighted means you cannot see things that are far away. So when you wake up in the morning, depending on how bad your eyesight is, you can't read the alarm clock or you can't read the clock. If you're in a classroom and you sit at the back of the class, I always did that. And I was always like this. I can't see what the teacher's written. Uh, I need glasses. Yeah, I'm not getting glasses. So if you can't see things far away, you are called nearsighted. Guess what? Farsighted is the opposite of that. So if you can't see things really close up, you are what we call farsighted. These are the layman's terms, the regular terms that we would use for this kind of bad eyesight. The doctor's terms for, first of all, nearsighted is myopia. Myopia means exactly the same as being nearsighted. But myopia and hyperopia are nouns. So because these guys are nouns, we have to use have. So you could say, I have myopia or I am nearsighted. They're the same. Or you could say, I have hyperopia or I am farsighted. Okay. Most commonly, we would use this, nearsighted, farsighted. Um, depending on what language you speak, maybe you use these in your language. And that's easier for you? Perfect. Do what's ever easiest. The next thing that we have is another noun. We say, I have an astigmatism. Repeat after me. I have an astigmatism. Your turn. Do it again. Okay. So I have an astigmatism. This means that your eyes do not focus well and everything is blurry. It doesn't matter if it's far away or close up. It's blurry. Things are like doubled. It's like you've drank 
a hundred beers and you're constantly having double vision. So if you have something wrong with your eyes, you're going to have to wear, as a verb, glasses. Now please be very, very careful. You don't wear glass. I'm sure that would hurt. You're going to have to wear glasses. It's very important that you pronounce the end of the word so it sounds like glasses. Maybe you were sick of glasses and you got contacts. The long form of contacts is actually contact lenses. But we never say contact lenses. It takes too long. We just say contacts. Now, some people, those crazy people out there, can get colored contacts. So you can actually make your eyes a different color. I've seen this. Some people even have contacts that have swirls. So their eyes look swirly and crazy. And some people get very unnatural colored contacts like purple. So be careful. That blue-eyed girl that you're looking at might really have brown eyes. Okay. The other kind of um, thing that you have to be concerned about when you get older maybe are a kind of glasses called bifocals. Bi means two. So bifocals actually have two different lenses in the glasses. A lot of older people find that their eyesight is deteriorating, <gasps> getting worse and worse. So instead of having to switch glasses from nearsighted, farsighted, you actually get one pair of glasses that have two lenses. It takes a lot of getting used to if you have bifocals because I'm sure if you look, you get confused and it's like you're drunk again. Bifocals are only in glasses. Now, maybe you are sick to death of glasses and you've tried contacts. You just can't take it anymore. Every day you clean the contacts, you put them in your eyes, they rip. I am speaking from experience. I used to have glasses. I never wore them. Then I had contacts. So when I was younger, people said, Ronnie, you need glasses. But I didn't wear my glasses. I did in fact get contacts and I could see again. And I realized that people were looking at me because I'm a little strange. But what I did is I had laser surgery. Hallelujah, I can see. Laser surgery is actually a laser or beam. <sighs> Let's go. They take your eyeball. They cut open. What? They cut open your eyeball? Oh, yeah. There's a skin that covers your, a, a layer of skin that covers your eyeball. They cut it open with a the laser. They lift it up. And they shoot a laser. And magic, it fixes your eye. Clearly, I am not an optometrist, and I don't really know how to do laser surgery. But if you'd like to send me a check for $2,000, I'll do your laser surgery. Just subscribe to my YouTube channel, English Lessons For You. I'll get you a sweet deal on laser surgery. Cannot guarantee the results. Laser surgery makes one happy lady or gentleman because you do not have to wear glasses anymore. If you have problems with your eyes, what's your problem? What's your eye problem? Are you nearsighted? Are you farsighted? Do you have an astigmatism? I, I was blessed with two. I had an astigmatism and I was nearsighted. I couldn't see anything. I got the laser surgery, bam. I can see all of you right now. See you later.